Hello everyone. Today we'll solve a question from Virial Expansion. A very simple question. Uh, you do not have to know any formula or anything to solve this question. Just you have to apply the logic of how to get a value from the given question. This was a CSR 4 marks question in 2011. So the exam is very closer. I request all of you to start solving the previous CSR question as that helps most than any other thing for this particular exam. So this question will give you an idea of how simple a question can be for 4 marks in your exam and how you do it. Okay, so the virial expansion for a real gas can be written in either of the following forms. PV by RT is equals to 1 plus BP into P plus CP into P square plus so on or the pressure can be replaced by 1 by V. In the question paper it was not by V, it was into V. So I think that was a printing mistake. It should be 1 plus BV by V plus CV by V square plus so on. So if BV is equals to alpha BP, the value of alpha would be. So what basically you have to do is now that it's like in these two equations you can see that these are equal and pressure is equals to 1 by V but BP is not equals to BV okay there's some constant called alpha which is relating these two equations so you have to find out basically what is that alpha value which is relating this to BP and BV right so the virial expansion of a real gas is given as so this is a given condition now what we'll do is we'll simply from the equation 2 that is this equation I will take this V by RT value to the right hand side okay so then it becomes pressure is equals to RT by V into the whole this same bracket 1 plus BV by V plus CV by V square that I have written here right now how do you solve the question it is the basic mathematics which you have done here 10 standard we just substitute this uh, uh, value which we have got p is equals to rt by v into so on in the in the equation one that is in this particular equation okay so once you substitute this in that equation what do you get pv by rt is equals to 1 plus bp 1 plus bp in the pressure term you just substitute with this equation so you get this value right i will not put my hands okay so pv by rt you get this value now PV by RT is 1 plus BP. Uh, just multiply this with the each term. So we'll neglect the higher terms. We'll just consider the first and second uh, uh, order equation, right? So 1 plus BP RT by V plus BP BV RT by V square. We'll consider only this thing because we just need relation between BP and BV, right? Now you have got this particular equation. Comparing equations 2 and 3. 2 is as usual as I said, this equation. This I will write down here and this is anyways there. Now if you compare these two equations, you can see that the equation 2 and 3, these are equal, right? So when RHs are equal, equate the right hand side values. So these are equal 1 plus 1 and then BV by V is equals to BP by BP into RT by V. So now we are correlating these two particular terms, right? Now on, on solving what do you get? You get BV is BP into RT that is alpha is equals to RT. Now in the given question it was BV is alpha BP. Okay. So in particular this place the question was alpha and you had you just had to find out what is that alpha value and you were given with PV by RT, RT by PV, PV and RT. So what is the right option? D that is alpha is equals to RT. Such a simple question appeared for 4 marks in CSIR. So, what is my request to all of you who are preparing for CSIR is that just keep solving previous CSIR questions, okay? You do not have to know the entire concept to, to just solve a question. This is a fact, this is a truth, whoever is writing CSIR, just go, go with it. You just solve the questions and I assure you, definitely you, you will get questions from the previous, uh, previous year's uh, papers. And you without knowing the concept also, there will be questions like this where you can solve and get marks in an easy way, right? So from now, I will be uploading various questions which have appeared in the exams and this will help you a lot for your entrances, right? Thank you.